This is one of the few times in a guy's life where you just want time to stand still. I've uh, been locked into um, an empty bar. All the doors are locked, no one can get in. And uh, I'm sitting here <laughs> uh, drinking beer and uh, helping myself uh, from the beer cooler. Uh, this is the hotel I'm staying at, and it's only open on Wednesdays, which was yesterday. And, and uh, today, uh, in about 20 minutes, she's going to open the doors at seven or so and uh, allow a few people, a few people, uh, guests to come in and uh, have somewhat of a little uh, going away party for um, her new found window washing friend. So <laughs> this is just surreal. Very, very interesting. Anyway, um, I had a great day today and uh, washed uh, windows in the entire hotel including uh, 10 rooms with multiple windows in each room, three stories, and all of this glass here on the main floor. It took me probably four or five hours, but I had a good time with it. Uh, this is a great place, and uh, I definitely will be coming back here again sometime soon. Just so you know, I'm not I'm not making this story up. There's just nobody here. So, <laughs> oh, this is so wonderful. This is uh, the best dream come true a guy could have. <laughs> well, this is a uh, 1940 LaSalle all original by one of uh, my new friends here, uh, Rick and his wife, Kathy. And he owns several old cars and he was intrigued by mine. So he tonight brought his down to the bar because uh, we're doing a little send off here, I guess, for old car people. This is a LaSalle, which is a Cadillac, he says, 1940. But my God, isn't that look nice? And the interior here, look at this. A little different than mine, a little. Pretty sweet. Oh, you got a permit already and everything, huh? So, I'm walking back to the hotel, which I inappropriately named as the Old Town Inn. And that's not even close. Holy smokes, I'm really sorry about that. It is called the old O-L-D-E Main Street Inn in Shadron. And uh, <laughs> it's gotten totally dark now. This is kind of interesting. I just went out to uh, get a bite to eat and you can't get a bite to eat at nine o'clock. In, in downtown Chadron, you just can't. So uh, I had a beer instead, and now I'm uh, going back to the hotel, and uh, I'm walking on the, I took a wrong turn, so I'm going around the block. And as I'm going around the block, it gets really dark, but that's okay, light's coming. You'll see me soon, so. Anyway, I washed the windows today, which was uh, very cool in the hotel. 
I learned today that the hotel has ghosts, which I kind of suspected, but uh, that's the way it is. And uh, the other things that came up today were that um, the ghosts, uh, and it's plural, <laughs> They kind of uh, come and go, and and uh, I'm not overly bothered by that. I found it very interesting uh, because it feels like a ghost type place. See, now we're back. Now we're back into the uh, light and back at the hotel. So I've really enjoyed this stay here. I've committed to coming back in May and doing their windows again and getting a free room and free beer, which is really cool. And uh, tonight there was a little party here in the bar and one of the couples that are here that I befriended was the guy with the car, the LaSalle. Um, he's an old car buff and mechanic so he's a resource and he and his wife would like uh, their windows washed when I come back to town in their house so it's like all right I got enough business to make it work so it, all in all it was a, just a great stop and it's a full moon oh it's, it's been a it's been an interesting 48 hours I'm ready to hit the road again uh, in old blue and so I'll give you an update uh, tomorrow uh, on what's uh, where we're at and what's going on got an interesting story about Lusk Wyoming which is where my next uh, stop is so uh, good night folks uh, Stay safe and uh, sign up.